It's my feel good breakfast show. Welcome back. This is your feel good breakfast show espresso only on SABC3. Thank you for joining us early on this Thursday morning. Now, as November draws to a close, it was time for the annual Vital Spring Classic, a very worthy cause where some amazing companies came out to support Vital as they raised funds for the Drakenstein Hospice. And we traveled all the way to Paul for the tee off and to have an incredible day out. It's amazing to me that it's already been a year since we last stepped out onto the golf course here in Paul for the annual Vital Spring Classic. Maybe where the conditions a little bit dicey with a pretty strong wind, but in terms of motivation, more than enough to get out there and enjoy a lot of fun with old friends out on the course and of course raise much needed funds for the Drakenstein Hospice. The Golf Day brings together suppliers and media partners to support a long-standing beneficiary and enjoy a round at one of the country's top golf courses. It was an excellent day. Uh, the weather was a bit uh, testing today, we had a bit of wind, but uh, the team pulled through. I think about three years ago we won it. So we come back here to try and defend our title every year, and every year it gets a bit more testing. <laughs> and these big charity days are good. It's good for golf. Yeah. I think golf gives a lot back here. Yeah. The golf is secondary. The, the charities are, are, are primary, the company's good, and uh, what a fantastic venue to play golf at. I would do it every day of the year if I could. We all know this is about palliative care and it's all about the nations and I think this is a fantastic course and I think if we have this next year we will we'll truly support it again. We're more than happy, we've made a lot of donations today and I hope, I hope they, they, they raise a lot of money. George, why is it so important for you guys to give back to the degree that you do? Well, I think hospice does, does so much good for people when they really need the help and, and it's something that we feel pretty passionate about in the sense that it's all good and well working hard and playing pretty hard, but you need to give something back to communities and, and Drakenstein Hospice is just incredible, the work they do with people when they're terminally ill. Drakenstein Hospice has been providing free palliative care services for 25 years, done largely thanks to the funds raised by the Spring Classic. Elizabeth, always wonderful to connect with you and your team. I know we've been walking this path together for quite a while now, but for the uninitiated, talk us through what you guys at Drakenstein Hospice do. We are looking after 440 patients in the Drakenstein district, and we also have three resource centres, and we have 250 children that go through those resource centres every day. Because not only do we focus on people with a life-threatening illness and an expectation of dying, but also with people with a life-threatening illness or a life-limiting condition and an expectation of living. So this has really changed the way that we do our kind of hospice work. Which makes the Vital Spring Classic all the more important from your perspective. It is just such a, a fabulous partnership that we have with them. A lot of our funding is for a specific project or a specific cause. But nobody thinks that you need petrol for your cars or maintenance or to buy new stuff or to paint your buildings. So this is just so big for us. It is like a massive gift. Katlejo and Genie D stepped up for Team Expresso. And lucky for us, it seems they won't be turning pro as golfers anytime soon. Today's not my day. Basically, it's the first game of golf that I've ever played in my entire life. I've had a few lessons, so I'm, I'm quite good on a mashy course. <laughs> I'm quite good at a driving range, but this has been a little bit challenging for me. Playing amongst the ladies is an enormous amount of pressure on my shoulders because they are trusting me to carry the squad forward and I've had two holes that I've done pretty well in. Despite the lack of golf skills, the importance of supporting a worthy cause and having fun doing it remained the focus. We all do this together as the Expresso family and we know why we've partnered up with Vital for so many years doing the amazing work and that we've been so privileged to be part of. And uh, to be able to cap it off at the end of a great and successful year with a round of golf, I mean, come on. The Vital Foundation will donate one rand from every pack of Vital supplements purchased to victims of abuse. Healthy families, healthy homes.